Hey, I'm Storm from the Kraken Workshop and this is how I made the filigree for my armoured white mage. So I started off by cutting up uh, some scrap warbler that I had left over from my armoured Jafar build. I then rolled it up into the sort of length and shape that I was, basic shape that I was after, sort of tapering a little bit more at one end usually. Uh, you want to also make sure that the base of your warbler that you're putting it onto is nice and hot so that it tacks as best as it possibly can. Um, so shape it onto the ar armor in the sort of style that you want to go for. Reapply a bit of heat if you need to, um, just to keep it really malleable and moving. Uh, I just used a basic wooden tool to help sculpt the shape in that I liked um, and press everything down nice and firmly. I just got this one from a dollar store, it doesn't have to be an expensive one and you can modify um, if you need to. You should also just a side note potentially use um, leather gloves or a leather thimble while doing this, especially if doing it for as long as I did, um, if you can because it does actually help protect your hands or you just build up some sweet calluses like I did. Uh, so heat the thermoplastic plastic beads um, and apply wherever you want really just around the rest of your filigree. Um, just dot them all on. Looks sweet. Nice and easy. Afterwards you just hit them with a little bit more heat to help them stick down and remove any fingerprints. Once I'd done all of this, I did um, also go through and reshape the armor back to my body because hours and hours and hours of pressing down on it and reheating it did uh, warp the shape out a little bit. So just do that. I did the older, heat it up, wrap around my leg, dunk it all underwater. It's a good time, under cold water specifically. And it's just like, it's like modern day plastic armor forging. <laughs> At the end of all of this, I literally just primed it up with some PVA glue, just a couple of coats. I let everything dry out for a good 12 to 24 hours between each coat because with all the filigree, it pulls like crazy. Nothing you can really do about it. Um, so just let everything really dry out between layers so you don't have weird bits shaping up in there. And then I just went over with a little bit of shellac to make it nice and extra smooth and shiny. And yeah. Thanks for watching my video guys, uh, put any of your comments and questions in the bit below and I will get back to you or comment or whatnot. Um, like and subscribe and all that jazz and I'll put the links for my social media in the description so you can check out the final bit of all this build all painted up and looking awesome. Thanks guys, you rock!